Hi, I'm Nora Young, host of Spark on CBC Radio 1, and I'm here at OCAD University in downtown Toronto with Kate Hartman, Associate Professor here. And Kate, what are we going to do today? We are going to make a simple wearable circuit using conductive fabric and thread. It's going to look like this. So Kate, what do we have here? Uh, we have all the materials that you need to make a, a basic uh, soft circuit. So uh, some simple non-conductive fabric, this is acrylic felt. We have a battery holder and a battery, uh, an LED, and then for our conductive materials, we have conductive thread and then conductive fabric. Okay, and the conductive fabric is actually iron-on, right? Yeah, it has a nice adhesive on the back, so you can cut it into whatever shape you want and then iron it to another piece of fabric. What I would do is just check and make sure that these things can um, sit in a place where I can sew through to uh, make connections between you know the, the negative hole that's here and the positive hole. Right, so it's got to be the conductive fabric has to be under those little holes. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And then um, the same over here. So something like that. And look at you can that's see just so by <laughs> just by putting it down there it does the trick. If they're loose basically that means that you have an unstable electrical connection. Um, so that means that your light will be flickering. Yeah, you don't want that. Yeah. So then, now that the battery holder is attached, we're ready to uh, put the LED on. Okay. So once again, being careful to make sure that the negative is matched up with the negative and the positive with the positive. Okay. Because LEDs are, uh, you know, have a polarity to them, so if you plug them in backwards, they won't work. Okay. So I'm just going to turn it on, and there we go. Fantastic! Yay! <laughs> That's a working circuit.